to the Adams School Theater. This afternoon, I am proud to present my version of Act 1, Scene 7 of Macbeth. Prior to this scene, the three witches told Macbeth their prophecy that he would become king. Macbeth wonders if this will happen on its own, or if he must interfere, because the current king, Duncan, stands in his way. Macbeth's wife, Lady Macbeth, knows that Macbeth is too full of kindness to take action on his own. She calls on spirits to reduce her femininity so that she can take part herself. King Duncan arrives at Macbeth's castle for dinner, and we pick up with scene seven. He's here in double trust. First, as I am his kinsman and his subject, strong both against the deed. Then, as his host, who should uh, against his murderer shut the door, not better like myself. Besides, his virtue, he like angels, trumpets only against the deep damnation that he's taken off. He, the naked newborn babe, told the poor deed, every eye, tears to drown me. How oh, now? What news? He is almost stuck. Why have you left the chamber? Have you asked for me? No, you not. He has. Walk with blood, those people too will get all the chamber. You 
Okay, there's that. Who dares to see another? As we shall make our griefs and clamor roar upon his death. I'm set. And then each corporal agent to the spirit. Fair show. False face must hide with a false heart. No. <laughs> 